Hey guys, it's Final Master Link, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Black Blind. So in the last episode, we started to get through Twist Mountain here. In this episode, we are going to probably finish her off. Actually, I just realized I think I... Oh wait, what? Uh... Okay... I have no idea why it determined it was, it was spring now. That's kind of weird. Uh, it, it isn't spring. It's still winter, but okay. So as I was saying, I, I think I actually forgot to get like some repels or something because I think I was meant to get a couple of those before I finished off this place. I know I healed my Pokemon because I think there's a doctor here, yeah. Mmm, I just have to try to think. Well, was could I go in that house down there when it was uh, winter? I don't think I could. Don't tell me it actually blocks certain areas. I. Uh. Okay, I'm just a little bit confused now. So how do how can I get back down there? Isn't the slopes what was allowing me to go down there anyway? Okay. Hmm. This is going to be different. I'm just going to run away from these battles naturally. So I was just watching NCS's uh, old uh, Super Mario 64 Let's Play. I mean, it's not super old. I think it came out in 2011. And I was kind of thinking, man, I, I ought to stream a platformer. Well, one of the Mario platformers. I know I just did a uh, Spyro. I wouldn't mind doing Super Mario Galaxy. I'd say that's... Uh, probably, probably my favorite 3D Mario game. Although I haven't really played Odyssey enough to, to, to determine if that's the best, you know. Okay, so how the fuck do I get down there, then? If I can't use the slopes, then how do I get down there? What the fuck? Are there stairs I can use? Okay, that's just a ledge to get to that, to get to the la that location. But I'm a little bit confused now. Does uh, does the in-game season does that change depending on like the actual date on the DS? Is that what it's about? Is that why it's been changing seasons, or is it just about how much time you've you've put into the clock? I... I don't understand. Okay, I, I didn't think I faced this guy before. Yeah, 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 whatever. I'm sure he's gonna throw out a rock type just to be a prick. I actually ate a little bit of sushi earlier. I'm not... I'm not the biggest fan of sushi. I mean, it's okay. I really don't like wasabi with it, though. That shit sucks. Um... I think I had a little bit of, uh soy sauce with it, though. You know, that's not bad. I should probably use a different move, because it's a flying tie, but I don't give a fuck, so, you know. I just want to get level 37. That's my goal here. If I have to switch out, so be it. Oh, that did pretty good damage. Damn. I really enjoyed uh, streaming Spider-Man last night. That was, that was some good times, people, let me tell you. Definitely be streaming it next Friday, too. I think I'm actually gonna record for, like, two episodes this session. I mean, they're still gonna be split either way. So you won't really... You're not really gonna tell when it's a, when it gets on YouTube. I just gotta check out that Subnautica that I've been having on my computer. I actually downloaded it free from Epic Games. I think recently they also had Meat Boy or Super Meat Boy on, on there, on their site, but I don't really think that's my kind of game, to be honest with you. That just looks like a lot of frustration, and I don't really want that in my games unless it's Dark Souls, I suppose. Alright, so enough of that. Okay, we can go down here. There might be a item in that rock up ahead. 
Okay, a Woobat. Big fucking whoop. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Don't do that. Actually, let me take out my item finder here. Okay, I'm assuming that guy has fighting Pokemon, so I'm gonna let him see me. I see an item over to the upper left. I'll grab it after the fight. So far, it's been an okay Saturday. Tepe. I'm trying to think what does Tepe mean. I, doesn't that mean fight or something? I, I don't know. It's been a while since I even practiced Japanese. I actually saw on my related videos apparently, uh, oh, what the hell? What the hell's it called? Uh, did you know gaming? They did a episode on Mother 3 on their, like, region locked, you know, uh, what do you call it? Segment type of video. Series. Ooh, is that it? Okay, cool. You know, when I do get around, I. I've been wanting to just make just like the first episode of that just for kicks and giggles and see if maybe it has room to grow. I mean, I could think of at least at least four or five games that I could put on that Japan games, which maybe I'll upload just like a little teaser trailer. I could probably whip up something to get together in, um, in Adobe Premiere or something like that. But, I don't know. It's just... I really think my time is better spent career-wise. Which is why I've been kind of researching certain branding agencies around uh, around where I live to apply to, just to kind of introduce myself. I don't have any experience, but uh, it's just, there's nothing else I can do, you know? Uh, other than, I guess, get information and do side projects, you know, in my off time. Just what I've been posting on Behance. I even put it, uh, links to it, like, on my Facebook. Ah, I probably should have switched out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me switch out real fast. I'm sure Magnifico can gain, uh, enough to level up to 38. Smackdown, huh? Oh, aren't you a badass? There we go. Uh, did I grab that item in the upper left-hand corner? I don't think I did. I like like that's gonna do dick. No amount of defense in the world is gonna save you from uh, just one more hit, unless you use protect or detect. And then you're down for the count. Boo fucking who? Razor wind. Uh, what, what, what does that do? A two-turn attack, Blades of Wind hit opposing Pokemon on this second turn, critical hits land more easily. That doesn't sound too bad. Hmm. I mean, well, it is a normal type, and that's offensive, and I don't think I'm really gonna use Detect. I think I'll get rid of it, fuck it. Because the thing with Detect, unless you know it's... Unless you know your opponent is going to use, like, a super strong move, like, something that takes a charging time, like, something like Solar Beam, then in my eyes, it's kind of complete luck if you can... If you can avoid a huge attack or not. Avoid this bullshit here. Ah. <sighs> I have been working a bit more on, like, my streaming and Discord stuff, so that is one good thing I've been doing. Ultra Ball, eh. It's not all... It's not that big a deal. I mean, goddamn, I got, like, 16 of those, I think. Gotta... Gotta... Get away from this guy. Really wish I brought more repels, but oh well. With six badges, I think I can actually buy Hyper Repels. Or are they Ultra Repels? I forget what they're called.
There's actually a guy on the Discord server that I'm a part of saying he uploaded a, a video for Parasite Eve 2. Which I've never actually played that game, although I'm probably still going to watch most of his video anyway. I mean, really, how much can you be spoiled by the first, you know, half hour of a game? So, is that a vending machine? I'll be damned. That's cool. Let's get a lemonade. Yummy, yummy lemonade. Let's get a fresh water, too. I don't really like pop anymore. Unless it's like Coke. I, I can't even stand, like... Uh, I, I cannot stand Mountain Dew anymore. I think it's garbage. Sprite's okay. 7-Up's okay. Um, it's another one I can't stand. Can I use these as beds, or...? Who the fuck lives here? Huh. The big ass bulldozer there. Oh. Okay, where the hell are you pointing to? Okay, whatever that item is, I, I guess I'm not getting it now. Uh, I'm guessing uh, the l most lower one is to get out of town, so let's check out this little cave here first. It looks like there's something in the upper right-hand corner. I can't tell exactly what it is. Just gotta run away. Oh, okay, so that's one of those Team Plasma members. Well, I want to see... Okay, wh where the hell does this go? Oh, okay, so this basically leads to nowhere. Okay. And I think that's alleged to go over there or something, so I don't really care about that. Alright, at least I know where that is. Uh, I, I don't know, maybe maybe the whole thing with the winter turning to spring in this particular area. You know, when the snow melts, I guess maybe it clears up certain paths inside the caves? I don't know. Huh, pretty strong. But you're only strong because you trainers are controlling Pokemon. So if you want to set Pokemon free, if that's what you want, you should start with your own. But taking people's Pokemon by force is not right. That is not real strength. He's kind of catching on. Hey, there you are. We found the thing we were looking for. We should head for the tower now. Get this Team Plasma has obtained the power to change this world and end, pe and end people's control over Pokemon. That's right. We must use force in order to right the wrongs of the world. Now let's gather around our king, our Lord N. Okay. I don't know what they found, but they got to go the extra mile to gain power and cause trouble. What a bothersome bunch. I'm going to stay here for a while. I want to think a little bit about the champ about what the champion asked me. Uh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. We already kind of knew that. Okay, maybe that does lead to the end of the town. In that case, let's go backwards and go to that one last entrance. If the goddamn bats would stop annoying me. Man, those bats look so stupid. I mean, honestly. Okay. And what do we have? Who the hell's he? If you look for something in an empty place like this, you can discover things, I suppose. But what's, well, you know, what's in here to discover? Ooh. The fuck is that thing? Am I in an area I shouldn't be? Is this supposed to have tougher enemy? No? Okay. Is this like one of those side things like when I went to that hotel? Hmm. I didn't think there'd be ice all the way down here. You'd think if you were going down it would get warmer. I don't know. 
I don't I don't know anything. God fucking damn this random encounter bullshit, dude. I'm sure I'm gonna have a, a lot of encounters when I when I play Subnautica soon, though. I heard you can face, like, certain underwater creatures, you know, like, maybe krakens and octopuses or something like that. Sounds cool. I know, I, I've heard you can also, like, make certain things that you salvage. Sounds like it has a bit of a Minecraft element to it. Uh... Okay, how do I get that item there? Oh, I see, I gotta... Yeah, okay. Better be something good. Flash cannon? I don't have a clue what that does. Not a clue. I I'm gonna assume it's powerful, though. Sounds like an electric-type move. Maybe it, maybe it works something like, uh... Like Solar Beam, like it takes two turns to actually execute the move. You know, let's let, let's look at it right now. Fuck it. Um. Oh no, it's a steel move. The user gathers all of its light energy and releases it all at once. It may also lower the target's special defense stat. 80 power. Eh. 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 I guess it's better than nothing. I thought it'd be like a hundred power or something like that. Uh, I don't want to deal with you, weird bear thing that doesn't know how to clean its nose, wipe its nose. I'm glad we're about out of this damn cave too. So I don't know if this is going to be uh, this video or not, but... Um, I think I'm gonna start leaving sort of a little... I don't know what you'd call it. What the fuck is that thing? What the fuck is that? It looks so weird, I, I kinda wanna catch it. I... It looks fucking weird, which is why I kinda wanna catch it, so... You know what? I like a challenge. Uh, I'm assuming it's weak against fire. Okay. It's gonna use haze. Who knows, maybe it's a really good ice Pokemon. But the thing is, I already have a water type, so why would I need an ice type? Uh... I guess Ultra Ball, then? I noticed how it doesn't have a gender. You son of a bitch. That- uh, no, well, it's an ice move, so it shouldn't do much against Funky here. Okay, let's try it again. Damn, dude. Fuck off with your Aurora Beam. It sucks ass. I don't I don't know how you managed to critical hit on that thing, but Oh, damn it. If I was using my mouse, I could just use a touch screen. Come on, catch that fucker. Mm, what now, ho? I don't even know what the fuck I caught, but I thought it looked cool, so fuck it. I think I know what to name it, actually. When its body temperature goes up, it turns into steam and vanishes. When its temperature lowers, it returns to ice. Okay. So I guess depending on the environment, it, uh... It changes form, I suppose? Uh... I think I know what to call it. Uh... Where's the capital letters? There we go. Oh, uh, I think it can actually fit all of it. Oh shit, how do you... 
Okay, that. Oh, damn it. It's not gonna fit. Yeah, I think that <laughs> I think that sums it up. I caught a what the fuck, guys. Yay. Let's get the hell out of this place. Hopefully in the next town we can encounter uh, Team Plasma's sort of stronghold, you know? Because I know they just touted how they found something that's going to change everything. As every organization in Pokemon seems to claim. Alright, blah blah blah, go away. Is there a route before the town? Who the hell is that? Cedric. Uh, okay. I just had a thought. Have you heard of Dragon Spiral Tower? Uh, I think so. Give this story a listen. Dragon Spiral, Spiral Tower is said to be the Unova's region's oldest building. Stories say it's the place where legendary Pokemon came to life or way they remain, they remain in deep slumber. I know it's just past Icarus City, but that's all I know about it. That's all everyone knows because, because no one has ever been inside. My daughter has wanted to investigate that tower for a long time. What, there's something I don't know? That kind of feeling is pure adventure, and I'm not too old for some adventuring. Away I go to have a look at Dragon Spiral Tower. Catch you later. Alright. I still don't know who the fuck Cedric is. Uh, I think he... I don't know, maybe he's a relative of a gym leader. I don't know. Oh, I was about to say, are there water Pokemon here or something? Or what? What the fuck? Oh, that's like a... Stunfisk? That sounds like a stupid-ass name. It looks almost as dumb as uh, Dunsparce. From the second game, or what's another one that looks dumb? Um, Phoebus looked dumb, that's for sure. Okay, so where's the actual... Wait, am I in the town? Uh, where's my damn... Where's, where's my map? That's not it. I thought I had my map registered, didn't I? Uh, there it is. No, I'm in Icarus City. Okay. Huh. Alright, check out the Pokemon Center. See, 23 minutes. We'll keep going. Let's talk to some of these peeps. Everybody has a different reason for their trips, and the same can be said for gifts, gifts giving. I'll give you this to commemorate to commemorate this encounter with you. That's actually a pretty decent move, Brick Break. Really good for fighters. Yeah, destroys Reflect and uh, Light Screen. Oh, I'm sure you did, like, 40 years ago. Ores that I adore, this is where you should laugh. Anyway, I'll pay you well for rare ores. And not just ores, stones, gems, shards, anything mineral, I love it all. Okay. Uh, didn't we get... Didn't we get something like that? Well, like a star piece, maybe? Oh, fuck yeah. Sold, bitch. $9,800? Cool. Um, I want to buy some repels for this, from this guy. Uh, I was about to say you don't sell... Max Repel, that's what they're called. I think I'd rather just buy Super Repels, a bunch of those. Let's buy five for now. Okay. Even though Hyper Potions are technically better at this point in the game, I still like, I still like to use Super Potions. I mean, some Hyper Potions wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, I like everything to be even, so I'm actually going to buy six of them. I think it's a little excessive to have ten at this point in the game, but... 
Alright. Let's actually heal our Pokemon now, shall we? So I guess I should probably check out this Dragon Spiral Tower. Although I could just do that next episode and just kind of explore the town a bit. Uh, unless the tower's like in town. Uh, they seem to apply it was just kind of outside the outskirts. Let's talk to this guy then. A legendary Pokemon gave help to the hero who sought ideals. Because of that, a region was created. And when its physical form was lost, the Pokemon became the Dark Stone. Waiting patiently for a new hero. I've heard that story since I was little. Hmm. Okay. If you walk in the wetlands, you might surprise a wild Pokemon into popping out. Yeah, I just figured that out. Is that... Is that an actual building, or is that just like a background building? Can't get over how ugly that son of a bitch is. Jeez. I wonder if it's... I wonder if it evolves into, like, a beautiful fish Pokemon or something like Beavis did. Although, I, I always thought it was weird how Dunsparce never had an evolution. To my knowledge, at least. What the... Oh, that's a windmill. Are we gonna play the Song of Storms in it? I don't think we can go inside. That'd be pretty cool if that was, uh... If that was a thing, though. Okay, yeah, that only goes a certain direction. At least I can go, like, around this. Okay. So what's over here? Oh. Oh, I see some items. Hidden items. A timer ball. Oh. Uh. And an ultra ball. Cool. Um. The fuck am I hitting? Oh, I can't. I I, I don't think I can go to a certain depth in that. Puddle, river, lake, I don't know what you'd call it. I, I guess it's too shallow for me to surf in because I'm pretty sure Cletus knows surf. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Fuck off, Shelmet. I don't want to deal with your shit. Run away, please. Seriously? They, they should take that out of the fucking game. They should take that out of the game. You just turning can cause a random encounter. That's fucking stupid. I mean, come on. I want my goddamn item. Okay, I'm standing on top of it now. This mirror does that stun fisk. It sounds like it's like farting. Like that's its cry, it's just a fart. And how nasty can you get? Oh, I forgot that crystal Pokemon was in my inventory. For fuck's sakes, game! I, I swear, I've never had random encounters this frequent in a Pokemon game in my life. I mean, come on. I just want the goddamn thing. Max Revive? Well, that is a good item. That is a, that is a nice one. Uh... The fuck are these ladies doing? Spin apart. Max and Twirl. Spin, spin, turn and spin. Dance, dance, two dragons. Some kind of ritual dance, maybe. Mix it up day and night, because today everything's alright. Okay. I assume that fills up uh, when it's raining more, like maybe in the in the fall. I mean, it's the spring in the game, so I I would think that'd be the most where it, you know, when it when it rains. The legendary Pokemon Zekrom shared its wisdom with the hero, and and defeated foes with fierce lightning. The hero and that Pokemon were as close as a parent and child. People were filled with awe and looked up to them. 
and that is said to be the po the beginning of what became ancient Unova. That sounds cool. All right, what do you have to say? If we live in a monotonous life, do we get used to it and stop thinking about changing it? To an extent, yeah. Listen, listen, I heard that Bryson was in the movies a long time ago. Well, who cares? They say ideals intermingled with truth and the Dragon Spiral Tower was created. It has been there watching us for thousands of years. I don't know whether or not this is true. Well, I don't know either. Perhaps. Okay, what is what is this? Pokemon fan club? Well, I'm kind of a fan of Pokemon being a trainer, so maybe check it out real quick. Welcome to the Pokemon fan club. Shall I check how friendly your Pokemon is towards you? Yeah, sure. Let's go with Cletus, I guess. Uh, it is super friendly to you. I'm a bit jealous. Oh, really? And there's a moon. Or whatever the hell it's called. I'm the chairman who loves Pokemon the most among Poke Poke fans in the entire world. If you're a trainer, will you show me how you are racing your Pokemon with loving care? Uh, I would assume your starter. Was level 5 when you met, but now it's level 40. You've raised it well, you must be affectionate. Okay, EXP share. Yeah. Uh, token of gratitude for showing me the great love for your Pokemon. It's definitely a useful device. Uh, I remember in Pokemon, uh... Yo, yeah, well, they actually made it so that it affected like all the Pokemon instead of just equipping it to a, to a single one or something. Oh so, oh, so Bryson is the is the leader here. Ice Mask. What the fuck does that mean? Okay. So he's an ice user. Um. And look at that! Look at that Pokeball way over there. How do I get that? Well, if I can face the trainer first, then I will, but... Okay, what's this? Hi, this way, please. Exciting, thrilling, zippy, chilling. It's pep quiz. Today's challenger is this person. Answer lots of quizzy questions and watch your brains get brainier. Okay. What is the sky squirrel Pokemon that has huge ears? And that start with a P or something. I think it starts with a P. Hint, hint. Uh oh, the audience is asking for a hint. It's part four. Well, no shit, Sherlock. If it is it multiple choice? Oh, it's like a fill in the blank. I think it starts with a P, doesn't it? It's not a patch rat, no. P dove, no, no. No, no, no. No. Okay, maybe I, maybe I actually forgot what it was. I know what it looks like. No, no. Chachu. Cragamol. Deerling, no. Dewalt, Ducklet, no. Bubble Amogla. Forest Seed, Frillish, Colette. Herdier, no. Is it? It's not a Joltik, is it? I don't think so. I don't know which it is. <laughs> Shit. Mm. 
Hmm. I'm gonna guess a Petrat. Or where, where, which one is that? Where, where, where's the peas? Peas, peas. Let me guess that. Shit. <laughs> oh, wow, I'm a failure, aren't I? We got a Paralyze Hill. I'm surprised he gave us anything at all. Oh, that was embarrassing as hell. Oh, oh, you can only do it once a day? Well, you know, by that point, you know, it won't matter. Okay, so after that embarrassing display, I think I'm going to end off the video here. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you later.